Ha! You wanna watch me play some video games? That's what you're here to do. You wanna watch me play some video games? Here's what you're here to do. Yay! 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 Friendly Bunnies video game channel. Hello! <laughs> it's been a while since I've been friendly. And your buddy. <laughs> oh, I make myself laugh. Oh, gee. The joke. <laughs> um, in all seriousness. Oh! You damn wizard. In all seriousness, I'm back. I knew I didn't really do it too much over the summer, did I? Nothing I can do about that now. Summer's gone. It's past. But one of my uh, family members had to have some surgery. I'm not going to say what type, but it was bad enough that we needed to look after him for a while. So I was unable to perform my duties as a friendly buddy. So, forgive me, I guess? But, either way, well, I'm going to be playing some Eldridge. And if you're wondering about that family member that I mentioned just now, he's doing fine. Oh, my voice. <coughs> oh. Look. Look at the mini map right now. There's a statue. Uh, okay, nothing in here that's worth buying. Now, I've been playing Eldritch a lot more recently, and I if, like past couple games I haven't been able to get any spells at all. And the ones that I do get have just been like crap. Poopy spells, which I don't really like, because they're useless. No matter w what type of situation you're in. Uh, yeah, so that's what's been going on with me. Oh, there it fucking is. Can I get this bitch? Ooh, my favorite spell, lift. Right now, I'm just doing some looting. Oh, oh, come on! Now, right now, I'm just doing some looting, uh, getting some stuff. This has to be the most boring, the biggest boar fest of 2014. But that, itself, is an accomplishment all on its own. Trying to swiftly swerve me, I swiftly serve, I serve you a fresh plate of get ass whooped. And there's, right now there is a game that has caught my eye a little bit, if you know what I mean. Sims 4. Oh my god, it looks really good, doesn't it? I'm not even, I'm just too excited for that. I don't have any money to buy it though. And I'm wondering, how am I gonna buy it? Oh. So I've come up with a solution. I'm not gonna buy it. It's gonna have to wait. Like a good little boy. Oh uh -huh, yeah, get a good boy. Hmm. No, I'm a naughty boy. I'm not gonna wait. Uh Naughty. Naughty boy. <laughs> that got weird. Oh, 
Why did I didn't hear that explosion at all? Oh, you want to go? That's what I thought. You, you ain't got nothing on this. You ain't got nothing. Look, that is just absolutely ridiculous. I've always just been. I've always said that this spell is overpowered. Watch. Like, do you. If you have enough. Oh! What? Did, if you have 104 coins on you, you can just fly. Not even hit the ground. You see? It saves you from fall damage. It helps you mobility. Mobility wise. Just all that fun stuff. Ooh. Gonna get that gun meat. Boom, jump. Oh. I haven't seen any springs. Uh I don't know. Let, uh, let me think of a funny story I can tell. Uh, yeah, that's the type of humor I like. Funny stories. Uh, so I'm gonna tell you a funny story. I ain't gonna fuck with this fucker. <laughs> no matter what. Uh, uh, what's in there? Uh, I really want to do it. Really want to just. Uh, <gasps> oh, get served! <laughs> I just. Oh man, that was just amazing. Amazing. Okay, uh... Oh, I got a good story. I remember when I was young, I was always kind of like... A little bit of ashamed of what my parents did, because... I don't know, it was like... My impression of what they did was like, oh, it's just, they just have terrible jobs. But... You know, so <laughs> I w when I was in kindergarten, I thought, oh, they want us to draw a picture of what our parents do for a living. That's what that's what it was. They wanted us to draw a picture of what our parents do for a living. So I decided to draw my dad, and at the time, my dad was a bartender. He still is. I'm, so, I decided to draw my dad as a something that's so close to bartending that it's like, oh, yeah. I can see why you would think that. Uh, he's a child. And I decided to make my dad a movie actor. <laughs> it was like, oh... I can still remember what I said to the teacher the day I showed her the picture. My dad's a movie star. He's always in movies and he's never at home. He's always in Hollywood. And the teacher's like, oh, so your dad's not home a lot. I was like, nope, he's too busy making movies. Uh, I think that's kind of normal, though, because you want everyone wants their dad to be the M Michael Bay, bringing all, bringing in all that, bringing in the movie millions. But uh, you, you, you do that, uh, yeah. so um, I was like. But that isn't the funny part. Uh, you, you, you'll, you'll get what the funny part is after I tell you. Because the funny part doesn't come till a little bit later on. The funny part comes when... OH SHIT! Hey! Oi! 
Let me let me hide a little. Buy buy uh waste of thirty coins, but whatever. I'll just stay in here for a little bit and tell the story. Uh so this is like um two months later I'd guess. You know, some time passes and I forget all about it because I forgot about that night actually. So parent teacher parent teacher conferences come around and the teacher decides to show my mother the picture. And you can imagine how that went down when my mother had to tell her that my dad isn't really a movie st star. I know you can, you'd think that by how sexy I look that, oh, his dad's got to be someone like George Clooney. He looks too goddamn delicious not to be. But no, I'm just your average Joe of a man. You know, average Joe, you know. Well, that rhymed. I'm, I'm gonna be the next Dr. Seuss, at the very least. Hopefully, my wife never gets yeast. Infections. <laughs> what the? Oh my. But, so. When. My parents, my mother at the time, this went home, and she told me that my dad was gonna be a movie star. And I was like, oh, 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 "This is continuing the story." Uh, she, I'm like, oh, I put down the crayons and the coloring book because that's what I was doing. I was. Coloring, coloring in a picture of Thomas Tank Engine to show you that. So I was like, "Oh my God, my daddy's gonna be in the next Thomas the Tank Engine movie," and that's what she, my mom told me. That he, he's gonna be the next Tank Engine. So imagine little old me. Learning my dad's gonna be the next Thomas Tank Engine. I was like, holy sh Nikes. My daddy's gonna be Thomas the Tank Engine. I'm gonna look for the books while I'm speaking. That's what I wanna look at. Then I still. This was all uh, about all for uh, get back at me, you know. Tell, teach me never to lie. So I'm just blanking out a lot. Sorry about that. Uh, so my mom comes home. Thomas the Tank Engine. Uh, I freak out a little bit, and when my dad get home, get home, I was like, "Daddy, Daddy, you're gonna be the next stop, Mr. Daddy." He's like, "What do you What do you mean, son? Rai Rai, Rai 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 Ad, Rai 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 Ad, Rai 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 Ad. What do you mean? What do you mean? What? I don't know what I mean." But he, he asked, oh, what do you mean I'm gonna be the next Thomas the Tank Engine? Thomas the Tank Engine is a little, you little stupid piece of poo poo. He is a real. Now let's go back to your calorie books. Oh my god, And then my mom comes in the room and says, That's what you get for lying. She didn't say that. No, but she was like, Oh, you shouldn't lie. You should not lie. You should not lie. And I don't know if this actually happened or not. <laughs> because I was like five years old at the time. 
and I have a shit memory most of the time anyways so, and that's what how I became your friendly buddy I don't want to lie to people anymore isn't that cute okay I'll see you later bye bye